Hey y'all. So the moment is here that y'all been waiting for that y'all asked to see and I'm gonna give it to you like I ain't never give it to you before. <laughs> I'm sitting like in a weird position but so today I'm gonna be showing y'all my product stash of all the natural hair products that I have accumulated throughout this year and probably a little bit from last year. This is also the time that I'm gonna, that I'm gonna clean out my stash because why wouldn't I do that? I'm gonna show you guys what I got and I'm gonna try to make this as quick as possible because I know I have a lot of products. So um, I'm sitting in my chair. I put it on the lowest notch that I could. And my stash is right here. Let me put it down so y'all can see. This is my stash. This is my stash. Just to give y'all a little overview of it. That is the stash. And this is what we're looking like. And this is what we're about to dig into right now. Okay? Y'all see some goodies? So I ended up putting the tote on my little stool thing that I have just to give me some leverage so I can like, you know, really peek into it um, and really show y'all what I got. So without further ado, let's get started. I do want to say some of this stuff might be old, some of this stuff is PR, some of this stuff I've used, but I don't even know where to like start because it's so much stuff. I guess we're just going to start over here. I don't know. So first... I have the As I Am Jamaican Black Castor Oil Water. I have two, but this one is like, it's barely anything in here, but I have a full one. I'm gonna got them during a Sally sale. I do like them. So I have this Refresher Spay. Well, Lavish Curls Moisturizer. It's by Curls. It's their second curl refresher. I really like this. I've been using it a lot lately, actually. Next, I have Ajwa's Beauty Blue Tansy Reparative Conditioner. And I'm just going to be naming everything I have because I don't want this to be super, super long. I have some Eco Styler Gel. I know I love this on my edges. Two color things that y'all will see in tomorrow's video of what I got from As I Am. It's their curl color. I got it in hot red. And then I got in copper. Next, I have... This, my black is beautiful scalp care balancing conditioner. I got two of these. They were like a dollar at all these. Who you know conditioner is a dollar? Ba baby girl. Um, like I said, I have two of them. I've never used them before, so let me know. Y'all wanna see something like that. Next, I have, I have the TGIN Curl Balm Moisturizing Styling Gel. I do like this. I just can't find a pair that it pairs well with, so I use it every so often, but I've had this for like almost two years, so it's about time to go. I have this. I'm going to throw this away because I've had this for like three years now. Um, This is the Mia Honey and Ginger Styling Gel. I do like it. It's just a light hole and I don't really use it like that, so I'm going to throw it away. So we're going to leave it on the floor because we're throwing it away. Next, we have Design Essentials Natural Hair Almond and Avocado um, Curl Enhancing Mousse. We have the All About Curls Zotos Professionals The Taming Cream. I really like this. I just haven't used it. Probably will get to this because it's winter and it's about not even halfway. It's a little bit less than halfway. Next, I have the Miel Avocado Moisturizing Hair Milk. Um, I bought this during a last Black Friday sale. Never opened it because I'm a party junkie. I have the Curls Cashmere and Caviar Collection. This is their hair jelly. I have this and never used this. So, you know. Next, I have some Yale Moisture Hawaiian Ginger Leave-In Conditioner. I do like this. It's just, this is very creamy and very thick. So, like, if you pair this with a gel, it got to be a strong, strong gel for it to, like, you know, get your curls right, you know? Um, next, I got this Texture ID Thermal Multi-Styling Foam from Texture ID. I know I love Texture ID, but I've never tried the foam. So, we'll see about it. Um, I have the Herbal Essence Mango and Aloe Define and Refresh Curls. This is a curl cream. Never used this. Bought it from Target like almost five months ago. Never used it. I know this is my favorite. This is upside down because I'm trying to save it all. But it's the Texture ID Curl Clarifying Shampoo. Y'all know I love this shampoo. I have a whole video and I will link it up there. My chef's kiss. If you see it, go get it. No questions about it. Go get it. Um, I have the Carol's Daughter Goddess Strength Define divine strength leaving cream um, i've only used this like a couple times i usually use this to blow out my hair i haven't used it in a good minute it probably be going trash but i don't want to give it because i do like it i have some not your mother's curl talk scalp and hair treatment oil i used it like once but it was like on my mama hair one on my own, so okay next i have the miel hawaiian ginger moisturizing styling gel really like this um i only have like a little bit left I think it will last me like maybe my whole head for one good time. I'm not sure though. Then I have, I'm going to do both of these. I have, oh wait, so first off, we have the big tub of Eco Styler. 
after that um viral com tiktok combo that i posted on my youtube channel tiktok and stuff i went and bought the big one i shouldn't have did that because what am i going to use the same anyways that's not the point um so next we have the two wet line gels i have I like this one better, but they don't sell this one anymore, so I have this one too. This is a small one, so like my needle doesn't work, but I like this one better. I need to use this. I think I'm going to use this. This will take me about like four more wash and goes, so good luck to me. So next, I have two Shea Moisture products. I have their Curl, Coconut Invisus Curl Shine Mask. I love this hair mask. It's one of my favorites. And then I have their Curl Stretch Pudding from their Red Palm Oil and Cocoa Butter Collection. I only used it twice. I want to use it again, but I think I should use it in the winter, so I think I am going to use it this winter just, you know, because I need to use my stash, you know. I have the Curl Talk Exfoliating Scalp Scrub. I actually love this. I love everything from the Curl Talk Collection, to be honest. Chef's Kiss. Um, I have some Jamaican Black Castor Oil from Sunny's Isles. I haven't used this in a hot man, but I literally have the smallest amount left, so I'm just going to do a hot oil treatment one day and get it done real okay. Um, I have some the Curls Blueberry Mint Hair Growth and Scalp Treatment. Um, I use this a lot with my mom, but I use it too every once in a while. I have some Pattern Leave-In Conditioner. I also have the gel, but I, the gel, every time I use it, it flakes. So I put it somewhere and I don't know where I put it because I want to throw it away, but I don't remember why I put it, so I'm going to throw it. That's my point. Next, I have two of my like staple shampoos that I go between the meal. Hawaiian Ginger Moisturizing and Anti Breakage Shampoo. And then the Maui Moisture Hair Care Lightweight Hydr Hydration and Hibiscus Water Shampoo. Love both of these. I prefer this one over this one. This one is more moisturizing. This one is more of a clarifying one than this one is. But I like both of them for moisturizing. Next, I have this Camille Rose Spiked Honey Mousse. I really like this with the Eco Gel. Great hair. Great hair, okay. Next, I have this Miel Pomegranate and Honey Curl Mousse. Y'all know I love this. I've been like using it a lot. Um, I haven't done a flex where I said I want to do one while my hair is straight. I don't know if I'm doing it because I really want to bring my curls back. So um, and next I have some Curlsmith products y'all. Y'all me Curlsmith and I bought some for Black Friday and y'all will see. But um, I got their Feather Light Protein Cream and then I got their In Shower Style Fixer. I haven't used these. I bought these so let me know if y'all want to see a video on them. We're moving pretty swiftly with this. I like that. Okay, so next, um, I have one of my favorite shampoos, which is the Miel Rosemary Mint Strengthening Shampoo. Love this stuff. Y'all need to get y'all some. If y'all don't get this one or this one, you, what are you doing? Man? What are you doing? I'm not even. A, I'm not wasn't a shampoo girl until I found those. So yeah, get you one. Next, I have this Dodo's Professional All About Curls High Definition Gel. This is more of the moisturizing gel, but I do like it a lot. I haven't used it in a minute, but I'm gonna use it because it says it expires. So I gotta use it. Then I have two of the Miss Jessie's products. I have the Pillow Soft Curls and the Honey Curls. I tried the Honey Curls, not the Pillow Soft Curls. I wanna try the Honey Curls again. Cause, I don't know, maybe I didn't pair it or something. I wanna try it again though. I have two of these. I have this one and I have a full one at home. Then I have this, I've never used it. Let me know if y'all wanna see a review on it. Yeah. I have some Gorilla Snot. I'm probably gonna throw this away. I've had this for like four years and I haven't used it in the past three. I've got who throw it to eco gel and stuff now, so you know. Then I have this Miel Rice Water Collection. This is their clay mask. I got the bonus size during their Black Friday sale last year. Never opened it, never used it. Still brand spanking and so I'm probably gonna use it when I revert my hair out. Y'all look out for that, yeah. Um then I have their Moisture RX um hair butter. I like it. It's just super thick. So like I would use this for like if you put your hair in the wigs or something. Because it's super thick for like a wash and go. I don't know if I could do that. And then um, I have some Talia Wajid. I have their green apple and aloe curl definer. I haven't used this in so many years. I The last time I used this is when I did a twist out on my hair. And y'all know my twist out days, ooh, it smells good. My twist out days is over. Um, They're not over, but I don't really do them like that. And that was like two years, no more than two years. They're like almost, this probably got going to trash. Then I have the main choice. This is the Alpha Biotin Infused Styling Gel. Love this. I did this with a braid out. Love it. I only used it once, so I need to. Y'all see, see the pattern going on. Y'all see the pattern, okay? I talked about this in my other video yesterday. Um, This is the Money Hair Mask from um, Color Wow. I don't even have to explain it because look, it's gone. Gone, okay? It's gone. It stinks though, but it's, it's gone. Um, then I have some Style Pack. 
booster this is the egg booster style stronghold styling gel um i used it once and i think the combo i used it with it made it like flip but it smells so it's much like grapes like artificial grapes for grapes um oh wait there's one else i have the texture id styling cream i haven't used this in a hot minute y'all know happy curl happy girl she loves this stuff i haven't used it in a hot minute because i'm not a twist out girl like i used to be i have a whole brand spanking new one at home too it's crazy yeah, this stuff must not the best but I'm y'all. I don't really need to use on my stash, like it's crazy. Okay, anyways. Um, I have some as I am Jamaican black castor oil curling cream. I got this the other day at Sally's, um, never used before. Never, I have the mixed chicks leave in conditioner. I got this at Marshall's for $9.99 when it's usually like $17 or something. Never used it. Um, what else do I have right here? We have a T Giant's Honey Miracle Hair Mask. <sighs> this hair mask has me in a chokehold. Okay, this is a brand spanking new one. I never use this one. I just ran out of my other one, so it's gonna come in handy, y'all. I think I run out of deep conditioners more than anything. Is anybody else like that? What do y'all run out more of? Conditioner, deep conditioner, leave-ins, or like styling gels and stuff? Oils. Let me know. I have some Yale, their curl smoothie. This used to be like my holy grail, like leave-in conditioner, cream-based powder. For so long, I don't know what happened. It's still full. I think I maybe used it once, or I probably didn't use it. I don't really recall. Um, so I have two Leash products. I have their protein and moisture balance deep conditioner. This is strengthened, and then I have Indulge, which is the moisturizing deep conditioner. I purchased this one twice. It's really good i haven't used this one yet i want to try it for the conditioner review so look out for that i have a repairing hair mask from purple essences this is their real botanicals one never used this i got from target when it was on sale i only want it's only like six dollars or five now ooh, it smells really good it smells like a candle to me never used it another deep conditioner review um i have another curl smith product which is the multitasking conditioner i really like this i love the way it smells i've used it like twice and I stopped trying to pair it with stuff because it don't work with other stuff. So it smells so good. I really, really like this. I haven't used it in a minute. I really like it. I want to use it under like a curl smooth gel. Maybe that hydro, not maybe the flexi jelly thing. Maybe that. The Mayo Seamouse Curl Pudding. I talked about this in another video. Love this. Super, super curl defining. Does it every time. I have a travel size of the Ajwa Beauty Veil Matte Mint. This is the shampoo, yeah. Um, I have the Texture ID Conditioner. It's upside down once again because I'm trying to get everything. And it's just the conditioner that goes to the shampoo. So I'm not playing around here, okay? Mm -hmm. I've used this before, but I use this on my boho braids. Um, I use this Jamaican Black Castor Oil Smoothie. I think I like this better than the... Um, um, I use my boho braids, and I think I like it better than the Color Hanser Smoothie from Shea Monster. I don't know. I just did. Okay, let's not talk about it. Then I have the Mish Scope Curl Defining Gel. I have this one that I bought for Black Friday last year, and then they sent me one. So I might do a little giveaway. Y'all let me know if y'all interested in the giveaway. I will give away some products that I've never used, so I don't want to give away products that I had dipped my hands in. Okay, I'm not going to do that. I want to give away products I've never used before. So would y'all be interested in a giveaway? I would want to do it during Christmas, so I think that would be really nice. Okay. Next, I have more as I am stuff. So I have I have their classic leave-in conditioner. I have their dry and itchy scalp care tea tree leave-in conditioner. I thought I had another one. I think I have another one, but I think it's at home. I think my mama used it. So I have these two. Never tried them before. I got them during the Sally's like 15 days of something last year. I don't. I don't know. Girl, I really don't know. I have the Curl Smith Bond Rehab Salve. I'm gonna use this when I redo my hair for like heat or whatever. I'm gonna use this or that Miel clay mask. I think I'm gonna use the clay mask because I've used it before, but I also put heat to my hair, so I'm gonna use this. I don't know how I'm feeling. Y'all see when the video come out, you know? Um, I have the Curl Talk Curl Activating Mousse. I have that. I have that. I used it once on top of Eco Slay. It worked pretty good for me. So I mean, um, I have some African, ooh, African Pride. This bottle is like messed up, but I have their Honey and Coconut Oil Nourish and Shine Shampoo. Then I have the Honey Chocolate and Coconut Oil Repair and Replenish Conditioner. Um, some of it spills out, so it look a little janky, but it's okay. Oh, I do have one more niche product. 
here. Um, I think this is lavish. Yeah, this is the lavish leave-in conditioner. I never tried it before. I want to try it with like wet line because I think it would be really nice. I've heard Curlila talk about it a lot. I want to try this. Um, they didn't send me this one. This one I bought from Black Friday last year. Um, we're not gonna talk about the purchases I make, okay? But this is not. I have the Mio Rosemary Mint Daily Styling Cream. Y'all know this is this used to be one of my holy girls. I haven't used it in a minute. I think I may have used it once. This and some wet line would be good. I heard the jello shot in this is bomb.com, okay? I heard that. Um so <laughs> I, oh, okay. Then I have the Color Wow Snack Free. This is the pre-shampoo. Um, this is the pre-shampoo. This is their snack free pre-shampoo detangler. I didn't try this on my YouTube channel. I tried it on TikTok tiktok um but i might do a video on it or just include it in a video one day i don't know it was including one of my faves so you know <laughs> y'all i think we got through it all i really do that's through it all hmm i think we got through it all the only thing i have left is all my eco state products so let's roll to that and we're back so here are all my eco state products and if you don't know all eco state products have to be refrigerated um, i do have a discount code it'll be on the screen for y'all if y'all want to purchase any eco state products but let's get into what i have so first i have jello shots this is what jello shot looks like my number one favorite gel i will always have this gel in my stash i don't care where i'm going or what i'm doing i will always have this and this is eco state jello shot right here i have it in this tub and then this is extra put in here but i want to use this all again and fill it up you know that's jello shot and i have chai latte which is their shampoo it's super super good it's one of the clarifying ones so i only use this like every two months every other month or every two months something like that love this i'm almost out of it that's why it's folded like this then i have their um sangria which is their hair refresher it's just a nice little spray that you spray in your hair to refresh your hair and it's in here and i'm gonna take this home with me i'm taking jello shot home with me too i forgot to say that then I have banana cream, which is their deep conditioner, also known as a leave-in conditioner. I really love it. I have a good amount left in here, but I have another pack at home. But I'm going to take this one to use it because I want to use everything up, okay? I just want to use it, okay? Then I have um, banana. Not banana. I have rice pudding. The rice pudding is their leave-in conditioner. I talked about this in my last video yesterday. Y'all saw it. This is so good. Especially with Joe's Um, And then... I have this is this is orange orange marmalade and it is a curl definer. It's kind of like a curl styling lotion to me. It really defines my curls without any like gel, but it has like a cream gel consistency, and I really really like it. I have tons of videos using Eco Slay products, so y'all probably already know about it. Um, and then lastly, I have the lemon buttercream. It's in here because lemon buttercream um her the case has a hole in it. And I didn't want it to spill in my fridge, so I'm gonna take it out and show y'all. But it's like I haven't used this much. It's just it's coming out at the bottom of the bag. I'm gonna take it home because they sent me a new jar, so I'm gonna do that. But lemon buttercream is so so good, especially for the winter time. So y'all need y'all need to try it. But yeah, y'all, that is that is everything so yeah y'all y'all see i have a lot of products and i know i know for a fact that i have some more at home i just don't have them with me um i brought most of my products with me to school because i know i like to do videos and i like to do my hair and i like to try out new things and things like that so i know i brought most of my hair products these are the majority of them so this is my um natural hair stash and my product junkie stash for 2022 this year i don't think i have that much as i had last year in my 2021 i'm gonna go back and look at that video but and i'll link it up here but that video i feel like i was that video was almost an hour long this one may be about 15 20 minutes maybe 30 i don't know yet with editing we're gonna see yeah i feel like that's all i got for y'all today i really hope y'all enjoyed this video and if y'all are into giveaways of receiving some natural products i would gladly give some away to y'all because we are so close to 700 subscribers and then we're gonna be close to 800 to 900 to a thousand five thousand ten thousand hundred we are so close y'all and i really really appreciate y'all and hope y'all are loving the countdown or the 15 days of curls mess so yeah if y'all have any product recommendations for me if y'all want any products in my stash then comment them down below and i'll make up a little giveaway for y'all and then also if y'all want to see me use any of these products in the 15 days of curls mist or in the new year then let me know and i will try to put that content out as soon as possible for you all right y'all i hope y'all enjoyed and i will see you in tomorrow's video Mwah.